Hi guys, it's time for movie review and I'll be doing it with you today. My name is Oluwashio and I am going to be your host for today. <laughs> okay, so I watched a movie called 500 Days of Summer. It was directed by Mark Webb and it was released in 2009. What did I think about this movie? Mwah! It was great. It was good. I enjoyed myself. Starting from the title, it's not exactly what it sounds like. Summer is not a season. Summer is a person. And oh my God, it just took me through the um, stages of a relationship. Not a romantic relationship. A friendship that had a little bit of romance in it. What is a little bit? A lot of romance in it. You know, uh, I, I really enjoyed it. And I would just like to say that it's something to be watched. For as many that are in a relationship that they don't know the name of the relationship, please, this table is yours. This movie is yours. Watch it and understand it. Okay, so what else did I think? I had mixed feelings by watching the movie because I had to go through a lot of emotional exercise. But it was all good. All in good light. For the casting, I would say I was not quite cool with Zoe Deschanel. She played the character Summer. I wasn't cool with her. I don't know. I was getting these horror movie vibes from her. Maybe it was her eyes or the way she was looking. I would actually have removed her for her role. And, you know, I did not like her for that role. Tom's character was cool. It was giving me childish vibes. And I was like, is this guy a mature guy or is he a young guy? But anyways, I guess it was just trying to show that we could, we can also have childish sides to ourselves. But, ah, that's how I feel. It can pass. Other things in the movie made up for that part. The organization of the scenes, they were non-linear, but it could have made someone confused. In that, you know, you have to keep up. What day is this? Okay, this is one day. This is another day. This is day two. This is day three. No. But if you're actually going to give it your attention, you would get what the movie is all about. So, what rating am I giving this movie? Weirdness and all. I'm going to be giving this movie an eight. Yes, because it's an unusual romantic comedy movie. And it made me enjoy it so much. It took me on that journey and I enjoyed my time. What did you think about the movie? Or what do you think about the movie for those that will be watching it? Tell me in the comment section. Do well to like, subscribe and share. Till I come your way next time. Bye!